Good morning, it's me again, Meli And uh, today we'll get back to our chess lessons. And uh, today's game, I prepare uh, my game against uh, International Master Walter Shipman uh, from US Open, uh, from pretty much my last uh, tournament. And um, in fact, the game uh, not been played against a strong uh, chess player, but I believe uh, one of the best lessons for you guys to learn uh, to study chess it's actually to study the games when um, one, uh, let's say, better player faced, um, let's say, a weaker player. So, uh, we have small history between us, between me and Walter Brown, uh, I'm sorry, uh, uh, Walter Shipman. So, that's our third meeting. Uh, first two times we had tough fights and uh, very first game, I also had the black pieces and uh, we played the same one as happening pretty much in this game. Uh, it's called uh, a Richter Wales of Attack. Um, and at the first game I played actually here in f 6 and uh, my opponent still played in c 3 and like I said, the game, uh, game was very uh, long and uh, I think after playing almost 5 hours I barely won. So uh, this time I had decided to uh, make a small trick and I played first move d5 uh, because I knew uh, the Walter wouldn't play here anything else except his um, pet line uh, Nazi 3 and that's what happening exactly uh, so and against this move um, I chose to move here bishop f5 uh, a difference here uh, I'm trying not to play not f6 and basically trying to make uh, bishop g5 move pretty much useless at this point so uh, the main line let's say is supposed to be here f3 uh, which is pretty much risky also because um, pretty much weakening uh, king side uh, of white and my opponent has some thoughts uh, I don't think so he actually expected this more water concrete, concrete and he, won, he went here bishop g5 which uh, a low black to play I think one of the recommendations of uh, Grandmaster Alex Mar Marazevich um, to play here f6 and what happened here, uh, black playing pretty much reversed uh, a Richter race of attack by themselves. Because now um, uh, I'm trying to prepare an e7, e5 move. So after bishop h4, now I played knight c6, making sure uh, in future I will play e5 and create uh, pressure on d4 square, e3, queen d7. So, as you see, I'm trying to break castle queen side and then start to push either e7, e5 idea or maybe uh, considering pushing my pawns on the queen side, I mean on the king side. So, and it looks like actually black running ahead uh, of development because um, we have already developed three pieces and we need to make a castle. We hope you enjoyed this video demo from chess.com. Subscribe today to finish this video and get unlimited access to our full video library. Your membership also includes access to Chess Mentor, the most advanced interactive training tool available anywhere. You'll also get full access to the Opening Explorer, Tactics Trainer, and much, much more. So sign up today and get serious about improving your game.